boys. Hello, boys. You happy to be here? These boys are saying, can we stay for a couple of days? We just want to relax a little bit. No more traveling for a while, okay? Let's relax for a couple of days. We're glad to be here. Hope to get some relaxing time for a couple of days. We'll see how it goes. Very pretty here. It's called Haven Hollow in Rolla, Missouri. It's a really, it's a small park. I think there's eight sites. You can see it's pretty full. We're actually very lucky to not have to unhitch. And look how pretty it is. There's a pond down there. Oh, there's the chickens. I had read that there were chickens here. Looks like they're way down there. And there's a pond. Hopefully we can walk a little bit and explore tomorrow. We got here before dark. Thank goodness for that. I'm so glad to be here before dark. <laughs> I was stressed about having to back into this spot. But luckily it turned out okay. It's We have to level out quite a bit, but other than that, it's okay. Sal's getting the electric hooked up. And it looks like we'll be able to not unhitch, which is a good thing. <laughs> These boys are enjoying having a day off from travel. And so are we. <laughs> Seymour's got Allie pinned down now. Well, I think Allie likes it. You like it, Allie? Ah, you like it? You two are funny. You're really funny. We're gonna go out and brave the cold to try to see this place. I've really been wanting to see it. It's four o'clock already, or maybe five, five. But and it's cold. It's like 46 degrees or something, but we're going to try it. We made it out for our walk and we're going to go try to get down there by those chickens. The chickens are down over there, so. I wonder if they'll be out because it's uh, kind of chilly out, but we'll see. Yeah, there's actually, I know this looks like all grass, but it's actually a walking path. It's actually a walking path and it goes around and around and around and around and down over there. Oh, yep, the chickens are out. I see them. Oh, I see them. Yep. I guess they, uh, they don't mind the cold. They don't mind the cold, but they might not lay eggs in the cold. See, and then the grass is cut here to make this path. I see. And on their sheet, they say, stay on the path and don't be a meadow stomper. A what? A meadow stomper. A meadow stomper? Mm-hmm. Something like that. What's a meadow stomper? Somebody who stomps on the meadow. Oh. Here's some chickens. They want us to feed them. See the chicken area here? They got a little house. Uh, I don't know what that is. And then they got their chicken house there. And then we got lots of chickens. One, two, there's one back there. There's one back there. And then we got one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, about eight here. Two, four, six, eight, nine. Nine here. Oh, there's like th three back there. We're gonna to try to feed them a little bit. Oh, they're scratching. They're picking stuff out of the ground like they're supposed to eat. You get the food and then you put the fence between yourself and the chickens and you throw the food like this. Okay, guys, eat. Girls. I guess they're girls. I think they're girls. I think they're girls. Hey, ladies. You gonna feed them? Sure.
Shackleberry Bank Bud and Broody Chick Inn. That's where they live. Oh, there's one hiding right underneath that uh, board over there. Mm-hmm. It doesn't look like he wants to, she wants to do anything. Maybe she's not feeling good today. We're going to continue on the walking path up here by the pond over here. Ready? I'm ready. We've covered quite a distance. You might be able to see the RVs back there. Our RV is the second one. Oh. We've made a bit of progress on our walk. This is fun. I like this little walk. Right there, I think, is Beaver Overlook. Or Beaver, I forget, Pond Overlook. We're going to go check it out. Beaver Creek Overlook. This is pretty here. It's very peaceful and quiet. Wow, this is very, this is nice. I like this. Slightly raining, but not on us, strangely enough. You can't even feel it. I don't feel it. But you can see the drops landing on the water. We're going to walk all the way over there, it looks like. Looks like we have quite a walk ahead of us. This reminds me of the beginning when we first started out. And we were at Hershey. Hershey RV Park, I think it was called, in Hershey, Pennsylvania. Oh, yeah, I remember that. And we were walking around. We walked there through a big part of the RV park. And Sal was saying how, how great it was to be free and... It was really nice. We're all the way to the edge of the path. We're making our turn. See the trees way in the back? We've walked all the way from those trees. Wow, this is going down. We're headed down a little hill here, which is weird. We don't remember coming up a hill. I thought I heard cows. Sounds? Mooing. Cows mooing. Hmm. Walking through the woods in beautiful Missouri After three long days of traveling <laughs> It's so beautiful and peaceful here See ya girls! girls you're really silly aren't you yeah I, I like chickens hey chickens you guys be blessed and have a good healthy life and maybe we'll see you tomorrow okay Seymour. There's Henry. Hmm. Where's Allie? Where's Allie? He couldn't possibly be in the cat cave because nobody ever lets him. <gasps> Hallie! <laughs> Hallie! You're funny, Hallie. Henry's looking at me. Are you thinking about a treat? Thinking about whether you should get up and run off for a treat, Henry? Haley, you finally got a turn in there? <laughs> Allie doesn't get many turns in there. It seems like Seymour and Henry have taken over the cat cave. We obviously have to get another one. Henry's been sleeping in the cat cave at night. Seymour's been sleeping in the cat cave sometimes at night, but lately it's just been Henry. But it's nice to see Allie in there. <laughs> Allie, you like it in there?
It's about time you got to be in there. Henry might not be the best at sharing. He must have not wanted to be in there today, so Ailey saw his chance, and he got in there. Seymour's good at sharing. Right, Seymour? I think they're nice and warm right now. It warmed up a little bit. We're still at the same park. We decided to stay an extra day. Uh-huh. What, what did Terry say? I, I heard her say something in the background. Oh, yeah, we've never, we've never made it to the West Coast. Maybe we'll see, you know, we'll, we'll see how things go. But uh, yeah, I've been so busy with work. I mean, I, I had to work since we were, I was working since April and we, I just got done like, gosh, last week we got back on the road and yeah. And now we just want to get down. We just want to get to Arizona. So, you know, beat some of this weather. It's starting to get a little cold at night. Supposed to get cold here tonight. There's a frost warning, but we'll be okay. We'll be okay. Our furnace, our furnace actually is not working. I don't know what's going on with it. Yeah, but we we have a space heater. So and that's been kind of keep that kept us pretty warm last night. So we'll use that until we have a chance to figure out what's going on with the uh, with the um, furnace. All right, brother. It was nice hearing from you guys. God bless you. Hopefully we'll see you down there. Okay. God bless you too, Terry. Safe travels. Okay, bye. Look at so, this pretty bush, just out of nowhere. Yeah. So I was just, so I was just talking to Scott and Terry. Yeah, they seem to be doing nice. They seem to be doing well. It was nice hearing from them. You guys coming towards us? Oh, how nice! You're nice little chickens. Are you warmer today? He thinks you're a rooster, but I think you're a chicken. That's what I think. I think roosters have like a high top head. That red thing is high and they might have a beard. Right? Right? You're a chicken. Tell him. You're a chicken. I, guess you're I think you're all chickens. Who's following us? Hey, buddy. You following us? Aw. You like us? We like you, too. We yeah, like we you do. Too. You want some food? We came out on another walk, and the chickens are more interested in the food today than they were yesterday.